So discovering your Dharma means becoming active and active again, learning from your feedback. And most people, they do not move, they stand still, they do not become active because they fear to not do the right thing. Universe then interferes with a corrective intervention and we call it karma just to make sure that you listen to it and to put you back on your track towards your own truth. So discovering your Dharma means becoming active and active again, learning from the feedback. And most people, they do not move, they do not become active because they are afraid of not doing the right thing. The universe then reacts to this with a corrective intervention and we call it karma. And you just have to listen to it to reorient your life again towards your own truth. So on social media, we constantly see people who have encountered their life's purpose, their ways, and we end up asking ourselves, well, which one is the right for me? And they may all sound different, but they end up to describe the same journey. Be assured that knowing how others have found their dharma will open your consciousness to discover your own dharma. And there are three options to get to it. So the first one is the jump into the cold water, probably the most famous but also the most feared way of encountering your dharma. You leave your old comfortable life and take the plunge into a new form of existence and you open yourself to what the universe has in store for you. In concrete terms, this means that you quit your job or that you put all your savings into starting a new business, that you move to another country or anything else that seems extreme but essential if you want to follow your dharma. And this jump is associated with a lot of risk, but guarantees that the person actually finds himself, because he basically has no other choice as to do so. So it's all at stake, and that makes us jump over imaginary boundaries. And this can be very scary and exciting at the same time. The jump is no guarantee that you will always end up where you intended to land. But promise in the end you always end up where you belong. So the second way is the transition that is probably the most widespread and safest way of encountering your dharma. So you have a regular job that isn't necessarily the most fulfilling, but it is not particularly stressful either. So you can spend the early morning hours, the evenings and the weekends on research and activities related to your dharma. And yes, this requires commitment and self-motivation and enthusiasm, but you will definitely succeed with that too. And the transition is a sure way to go over to living your dharma without the stress of not knowing how to pay the rent at the end of the month. So you try yourself out before you quit. The third way is the accidental discovery. So it is your dharma that finds you and not the other way around. And there are no coincidences. They're just situations that look like a coincidence. Be assured that the universe knows much more about our abilities than we will ever realize. We just have to follow our enthusiasm. And we are constantly being prepared for what comes next. We just have to listen and be very much aware of it. The random dharma is not really a coincidence. It just looks like one. So 
that so-called surprise dharma is your destiny and makes you feel really relaxed. It takes courage to constantly devote oneself to one's dharma. And uncertainties can never be completely ruled out. However, they can be minimized by planning ahead. But not everyone is a planner ahead. So some also learn in free fall. Go to the one way, to the one option that suits you best. And tell me in the comments below which of the three options corresponds to your life's journey. Is it the jump? Is it the transition? Or is it the accidental discovery? If you like this video, please share it. Make sure that you subscribe to my YouTube channel. I will be back two weeks from now with more insights on how to get closer to your Dharma, your life's purpose. Until then, take care, stay safe and bye for now.